everyone, how are you doing today? Slightly more casual video from me today because I'm not going to be on screen for very long in this video at all so I don't care that I'm in my dressing gown and snuggled in bed. But I was inspired this morning, I was talking to The Reading Wren, please go check them out, I will link them below, and they were saying that last year they hauled 200 books and it got me thinking, how many books did I actually haul last year? So in this video I'm going to be going through my shelves, my Kindle, everything and I'm just going to count how many books I hauled. And like I said, I'm not going to be on the video, I'm going to be recording me holding the phone and counting physically on the shelves because it will just take so long to go through and pull everything off. So we're going to go through my shelves, we're going to count, we're then going to go downstairs and count from down there and then I'll probably do screenshots of and like screen recording of the rest so sit back enjoy and let me know in the comments have a guess at the start and then let me know in the comments if you got the, it anywhere right anywhere within five to ten books i'd say you win i thought 200 was a lot but i'm now starting to think i'm going to be around about 150 at least i think it's going to be at least 100 that i hauled last year so let's go, shall we? I forgot to say, books I'm counting are only books that I bought. Maybe I'll do two tallies, books that I've bought and then books that other people bought for me. So then I can see how many came into the house altogether, but I feel like I wanna focus on these are books that I hold for myself rather than these are books that other people bought for me. So yeah, I'll do two tallies, but the only one that I'm actually counting towards this video is books that I have bought for myself. Let's go. Okay, let's go. That was bought for me. So that's one for buy for me. Uh, did I get that last year? I don't think so. Yeah, one, two. Bought last year for myself, bought for myself. That was a gift from Shah, bought for me. <laughs> Gift from Shah, bought for myself, gift from Charlotte, that was this year, that doesn't count. Older, ooh, yes, I bought that in Waterstones last year. Bought from Yelk, so yeah, I think that was Christmas 2021, so no, that was Christmas 2021. Yeah, I bought that last year. Even though I read that a long time ago, I think I actually bought the physical copy last year, so yeah. Uh, that was a gift. Yeah, that was a gift from TikTok, from Ellie. Yep, I bought that. I bought that. I bought that. <laughs> I bought that. I bought... No, that was pre... That was 2021. Whoop, whoop. Uh, I think all of these were like before. Yep. Yeah. I have some biscuits. <laughs> Gotta have reading snacks always available. Uh, let's go. Um, an arc that. That was technically a gift, so I'm not counting that as I bought. I did buy that. I bought 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 that. <laughs> yep. That was a chariot shot by. That was one of the first books I got in the year. That was the first book of the year. That was the second book I bought in the year. That came in a book box, so technically, yeah. Uh, yep, that was January. I, nope, I think I've had that for a while. Yep, I bought that in October at Waterstones. Yep, I bought that from Vinted. Bought that in the Orbit book sale. Bought that in the Orbit book sale. Uh, charity shop. Charity shop. I have way too many of these. Ugh. Whee! Whoops. <laughs> Everything goes flying. Uh, charity shop. Charity shop don't remember where I got that from. I think that was maybe Charity Shop. 
Oh god, that is terrible. Why do I not remember where I got this from? I have no idea where I got that from, but I got it. Uh, Yalk. Charity shop. Uh, bought that for reading group. Charity shop. My dad gave me that to borrow. Charity shop. Uh, that was my local Morrison's. It was on the shelf. And all of those were bought this year, except my Bible. Obviously, I've had that for a very long time. Yalk. Already had all of those. Yalk, charity shop. Oh, I know where I got the uh, last library. I got it from the works because it was the same day that I got that. Uh, that was a gift from Char, I think, or Charlotte, somebody. I need to double check. Nope. I bought that for myself after buying it for Char. Charity shop. Charity shop. The works. Charity shop. Uh, charity shop. Yalk. I think that's it for in here. So on to my unhaul box. I forgot my bed stack, so charity shop. <laughs> uh, vinted. I bought that from Chloe. Charity shop. Gifted to me by Kevin at Much Ado About Books. Let's go check somewhere else. Okay, downstairs. So we have bought in Waterstones, gifted for Christmas from Charlotte. Technically, I didn't haul this. This was a gift from the publisher. They just kind of shocked me and surprised me with it. So I'm counting that as gifted. Then let's go over to the other bookshelf. Bought in Waterstones, already had, bought at Yalk, gifted at Yalk, gifted from the publisher, that was an Arkcent, Arkcent gifted, bought in Charity Shop, gift from Charlotte, Charity Shop, gift from the publisher, I actually ended up with a lot of gifts last year, gift from Charlotte, I think that was last year's birthday. Uh, all of those I already owned. We then have uh, bought, already had, already had, bought, bought, already had, bought for myself, bought for myself in a sale, bought for myself because it was for like three quid off Amazon. Oh, charity shop. Bought for myself because I just really wanted to. Charity shop. And then the Nalini Singh shelf. Oh, wait. No, I don't think I bought... Wait, that was a gift. Who sent it and when? Uh, I think Shah bought me that. Or Kevin. For some reason I've lost the thingy for it, but someone bought me this. So if you can remember that you bought me The Gravity of Us, then please tell me who you were so I can remember to say thank you again. Uh, and I don't think I bought any physical Nalinis last year. No, I didn't. Yes, I did. But I don't remember where it is. I'm sure I did. Anyway, yeah, those are those oh and i have one more which is the law of the forest that i've not even looked at yet okay those are the physical books so that's it that i can find of the physical books so what i'm going to do now i have my kindle with me i'm just going to open that look through it oh 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 daughter of the moon goddess bought was that bought for me or did i buy it yalk bought it at yalk <laughs> I have too many books. 
Thanks for in inspiring me, Ren. Thanks. Okay, so here is my library on my Kindle. So these were all this year. Let's get to Clap When You Land. I bought uh, Arc, 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 Arc. There's a lot of arcs on here. Uh, all of these are arcs apart from that one that I got last the year before. So all of these were arcs that I got last year. Wicked Fox and that has the uh, sequel to it as well. So that's two to add. Untamed Vixen, I bought. Glow, I bought. Bromance Book Club was Kindle Unlimited. So that doesn't count. These were all free books that I got. So technically I did haul them, so I will count those. So one, two, three, four, five there. One, two, three, four, five there. Uh, one, two, three, four, five arcs. One, two, three arcs. One, two, bought. These were all gifted at the end of 2021. Okay, so actually, I didn't get too many in 2022 ebooks. I thought I got a lot more than that, but most of them are ARCs, which is interesting. Woo! Awesome. So now it's time for the final bit, which is the audiobooks. Okay, finally, I forgot I could get my audio audible library on here. So we have. I've just checked all down here and these are all pre-2022. Uh, these were all pre-last year. So the first one I have for last year was House of Sky and Breath. Or was it Shadow, Shadow of the Fox? So we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. I only have eight audiobooks from last year. Uh, let's go count. Okay, I don't know why my camera's so grainy. That's weird. Okay, so I've just finished counting and I can confirm there were 95 books that I bought for myself and 33 were, were gifted from friends or family, arcs that had either been sent to me by the publisher or that I got on NetGalley for a grand total of, I haven't counted... So that's a grand total of 136 books that I hauled or accumulated in 2022. I read 86, uh, I read 89 books and of the 89 books that I read, I read 20 that I purchased last year. So yeah, I, it's not as bad as I thought. It's certainly not 200, <laughs> which I was like, oh God, what if it is? I now have a rule because I was going into charity shops and just any book that caught my attention, whether or not I'd heard of it, I grabbed. Now I'm trying to be a bit more conscious and focus on books that either are already on my wish list or that are sequels to things that I want to continue in a series. So I am focusing more on that. Ebooks, I'm definitely like I've unsubscribed from. I used to get daily emails with deal book deals and like the 99p daily Kindle deals. I've now stopped checking those. I don't get emails for those because I again was buying books just because they were there rather than because I was actually interested. And like I said with Audible, I've cancelled my credits there because I've got enough books to keep me going for now. So yeah, it's not a book buying ban. I don't like doing book buying bans anymore but I'm definitely trying to be a bit more conscious about what I'm buying and why am I actually buying these books is it just because I want more books on the shelves or is it because I actually really want to read them so yeah let me know in the comments do you keep a track of your books do you know how many books you hauled last year are you too scared to check because honestly this was eye-opening for me I I had a lot more ebooks and a lot more arcs than I thought, so I really need to be more on it with arcs this year. So yeah, let me know. Uh, sorry if this was a bit of a chaotic video and a bit all over the place, but I hope you enjoyed it anyway and got a little bit more insight into the books that I've got. And it was kind of doubled up as a bit of a book tour, but I will be doing a full physical TBR breakdown very, very soon. 
anyway i'm gonna go i hope you enjoyed that i hope you're all good i hope staying safe and until next time